In this video, we're going to look at solving equations involving the natural exponential e and natural logarithms log base e. We'll start by reminding ourselves about the laws of logs. The first law. The second law. And finally, the third law. This really is what it's all about. We use logs to solve problems in this form where we're looking to solve for x and x is in the power. The index is the log. We've been working up to now in log base a or commonly log base 10. Ln is log base e. So we're now looking at y equals e to the x, exactly the same idea here with a equal to e and log base e here. Remember this really, really important relationship and this one here. If y equals e to the x, then x equals ln y. So for example, we're solving e to the x equals 7. Well, we could use trial and improvement. It would take us quite a while to get to x equals 1.95. Or we can use our laws of logs. If we log both sides, because it's e to the x we're dealing in, we've used log base e, ln. So e to the x equals 7 becomes ln e to the x equals ln 7. Well, ln e to the x is the same as x times ln e. If we remember in base 10, log to the base 10 of 10 is 1. In fact, log to the base a of a is 1 because a to the power of 1 equals a. Remember here, and then log to the base 10 of 10 equals 1 because 10 to the power of 1 equals 10. Similarly here, log to the base e of e to the x is just going to be x. It's the power. So ln e equals 1 because log to the base e of e equals 1 because e to the 1 equals e in the same way as 10 to the 1 equals 10. We can now see that we can just take out the ln e which equals 1 and we just get x equals ln 7 and we can always do that with the e to the x. ln e to the x ln e to the function of x will always equal the power. And then it's just on the calculator put in ln 7 and we get 1.9459. Okay let's try this one then. Slightly more difficult. But again, using our log laws, e to the 3x equals 7 over 2. We're just dividing by, so we get 3.5. If we then natural log both sides, we get ln of e to the 3x equals ln 7 over 2. We then take the power in front using the third log rule. Again, remembering this with the ln e, so that becomes 1. And then we can use the calculator to solve. 
Don't forget it's x we're looking at, so we divide by 3 and there's our answer. And then here's another example. This time, well, let's get rid of that one first. And then again, log both sides. Remembering that ln e is one. A bit of manipulation. Subtract the 2, divide by 3, and we get x equals 0 0.026.